Hey everyone, it's Victoria and I'm in the kitchen now. I moved around my house. Look at this orange. Could you see that color? There's like a reddish orange inside of it. How spectacular. <laughs> I They call them blood oranges, but I don't like that name. So I'm not going to call it that. I'm just going to call it reddish orange. Okay. So I'm going to be squeezing them, baby. Okay, I just made a tabbouleh salad. Christina, you know it, because we're both Lebanese, part Lebanese. I didn't mix it in yet, but this baby's got like, I don't know, tons and tons of parsley and cauliflower all ground up. I have this little mini grinder. I'm going to put lemons in that soon, after the oranges, of course. It's, a, it's, it's like this little brawn thing. Okay, it just you put it on top and then you squeeze it, you know? That's kind of cool. I mean, it took a little bit of time because it wasn't a big, humongous food processor, but great for traveling, great for, you know, just like, you know, if you have the time, you just keep doing a few more, a few more of those. I think it's easier, actually, because the big food processor, you have to take the whole big thing out, and it's a whole struggle. I don't want to struggle when I make my food. So, okay, so what else can we talk about besides food? Mm, I don't know, running, food, running, food, running, yawn, <laughs> who's bored? Um, I mean, look, I, I'm interested in it, so I watch videos all the time about food, running, and stuff like that, you know? Food meaning fruits and vegetables, and, you know, how to make it more exciting sometimes or whatever. So what's in my tabbouleh salad? Okay, I'll tell you exactly. Uh, cauliflower, tomatoes. Cucumbers, mint, and parsley. Oh, and red pepper. Red bell pepper. And about four lemons and a lot of lovin'. How about that? I had to put my hair up for the kitchen because, you know, you have to be very hygienic. So that's my tabula salad. Mmm, don't you just want to dive right in? <gasps> yeah, I know you do. But you can make one yourself. That was really loud. You can make one yourself and stop whining, okay? Just vegetables. Alright, so later on I'm going to make a, um, it's really hot outside, so I'm going to make an orange juice mix with, and you can mix some fruits, okay, it's high water content, peaches baby, peaches, alright, that is a really good mix, and a bit of, a little bit of vanilla bean, and it tastes like a real, like, cocktail, I, I learned this from Dr. Graham's Health and Fitness Week, I was in like heaven when I drank this thing. Delicious. You could do it with nectarine also. I didn't think you can combine those two, but you can. So that's what I'm making tonight for the little kitties. And then I'm going to take a little bit of mint and put it on the top. So cute. Alright, little garnish. And that's it. Alright, sign and off. Friend me on Facebook or just go to One Fruit at a Time on Facebook and I don't know, subscribe to these videos. Okay? That's it. That's all I have to say. I'll let you know how my smoothie turns out. No, I won't. I already told you how it turns out. It turns out great, okay? So trust me. Just make it yourself. Right now. In a second. Bye.